Right then guys, this time we're looking at something very beautiful and just absolutely stunning when it comes to RGB. It is the Nebula 240mm all-in-one liquid cooler from Inwin. Big thank you to Inwin for sending this over. I've been wanting to work with you guys for a while. So, we'll get into a bit of B-roll, then we'll get straight into thermals. Let's get to the B-roll. Hope you enjoy. Okay then, so, we have the NR24 liquid CPU cooler from Inwin. Big thank you to Inwin. Let's have a look. specs but here that is what it is actually mounted for i don't see am5 though perhaps it'll just be a new version Ooh. okay so mount then these are the fans so look. I would have preferred a standard ARGB connector, but that is fine. Okay, so this is everything included. Two fans, which do come in these little pouches like that. You've got the mounting brackets, which are in here. Of course, it, do oh, it does come with an RGB connector, so that's good. Uh, fan splitter, and then I'm assuming all the brackets. Ooh, wow, I actually do like that. That looks nice, very nice. And of course, you've got all this in, you've got there. Does it come with any thermal paste? Let's have a look. Thermal paste. It does come with an RGB controller. That is actually good. AMD. Whoa. Okay, so there's a lot of mountain. Oh, it does come with thermal paste. Very small tube, of course. Over there. And we've got the brackets, which is for LJ1700. Then we've got, I'm assuming, AM4 in here as well. So, now, let's take a this. Take a look at this. So, what makes this unique is this. Basically, it looks like a crystal ball. But, of course, it's not. It's the RGB effect and... With Inman on it, and I will say that does look rather nice. Now, yes, the pump is outside, so at least we aren't going to worry about orientation. Right, then, guys, a little bit of an update in the Inman NR. 24 all-in-one liquid cooler. I have added an extra CPU to the benchmark tests for thermals It is now the 5600 G as well as the 3600 and of course this AIO is Absolutely gorgeous. It is a nebula theme. So basically space. So make sure that you continue to watch <music> The fans are very noisy. What I will do is a real test right here. Right, this is the fans at a thousand RPM. Barely hear them, okay? So we go to here, right here, go 100%. Yeah. Oof. It hits 1900 RPM and it starts to get a bit loud. Oof, thank you for that. Now, 
what I will say about this AIO is the the thing I like about it is the overall design. I would have liked a start like a nebula theme for the fans, but of course you can't do that. But that's just me being picky. <laughs> So when it comes to the overall look and the design, I think it's very unique. When it comes to the LGA support door, it does have a in-wind bracket on the back, which is very, very cool because the actual socket compatibility is in built into the bracket itself, which I found very good. And overall, the... RGB effect is just outstanding. So, I would like to thank Inwin for sending this out. I hope that maybe I could get that case that you build. I'd love to ch change my test bench case. Maybe use that if you guys wouldn't. If you guys would mind sending it out to me, but of course if not, then another case I wouldn't mind checking out or another AIO. But for this review, very good. RGB is absolutely stunning. And overall, good product. And this is Rich from Welsh Tech. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like. And as always, goodbye.